Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Getting Out of Bed with Micah, where I take you along with me on my journey as I grow in discipline through getting up early and starting my day off in a productive, successful way. Uh, so today, it is Tuesday. Um, I'm a bit rushed. This is my first day back to, like, real life work and all of that. Last week, um, I was, you know, I spent most of the week getting my phone and car straight and everything. Um, and so kind of getting back into normal life today. Um, getting back to normal life, not going real well. Um, failed epically today um, with getting up. Um, I didn't get up until like 7.45, uh, which is crazy late. Um, so, yep, but you know, it is what it is. We just fight, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going. You only fail if you quit. Um, so, yeah. Um, but anyway, so I did have enough time to read, you know, a little bit, um, and kind of rush through everything. Um, but yeah, so what really jumped out at me in my Bible reading today, though, um, was reading in John chapter 16. And we see here in verse 26, 27, um, Jesus says that, you know, in that day, you will, you know, ask the Father my name. I'm not saying that you, that I will ask on your behalf, because the Father loves you because you've loved me and you've believed that I'm from him. Um, and I really love this, like, kind of, like, I almost feel like this kind of, like, hidden point in here, um, but it's so super important and huge because essentially what Jesus is saying is because you've received me, you now have an open door to speak to the Father about your life, about the things that are going on, to speak to him and to know him and to have a relationship with him and for him to, you know, help you in your life and to guide you and lead you, you know, through everything that you do. And this is such an awesome thing for me because this is so huge in my life. Like if I didn't have an open door to communicate with God and to, you know, walk through life with him and for him to work in my life, then I don't know what in the world I would do. Like, this is so huge and so awesome to me. So I really loved, you know, reading this and being reminded of this, um, that it's not just that, you know, I'm just, you know, over here in my corner and, you know, Jesus speaks to God for me because I'm not capable and all of that. No, because of my relationship with Jesus, I have an open door to fa to the Father, to my Father, God. Um, so super awesome. Really love that. Really encouraging. Um, and I still have the open door to speak to my Father, God, um, even when I fail horribly um, at getting out of bed because he still loves me even then. Um, crazy, I know, uh, blows my mind, uh, but anyway, um, so yeah, uh, that was kind of, you know, my morning, um, like I said, a little short, didn't get a smoothie today, you know, none of the things, didn't get to go walking, didn't get to exercise, didn't get to read other books, didn't get to, you know, do any of the things other than that that I like to do, but got some time in the Word, and that's the number one thing in my life, so we pick up, we move on, and we keep going. Um, but yeah, so that'll be it then for today's Getting Out of Bed with Micah. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to let me know what you think in the comments. And always remember that you are important, that you are valuable, that you matter, that Jesus loves you, and so do I. And I'll see you next time. Toodaloo! Bye!